No question. We wanted to keep the series and the rivalry going with UIC. Um, Howard and I spoke right away. I think we signed a four-year deal a couple days right after uh, it was announced we were going to the Valley. Both programs, I mean, there's a, a history to the pro, you know, being in the same league in the horizon, you know, 30 minutes away. It's a great rivalry. It's The city schools should play, and uh, this is a great game for both programs every year, and I hope we continue it for a long, long time. You know, playing and winning on the road is part of advancing your program and building a championship team. However, you know, we've been six out of eight on the road, and it's going to be really nice to come home. Uh, the students have been awesome this year. They have been made a difference. Um, the student section has been packed, and it just means a lot to us. So I know the comfort level of not, being, not playing here for a couple weeks. Our guys are excited. I hope the students are excited. We need them to come out. They make such a difference for this atmosphere. And for a rivalry game like UIC, I know they're going to bring a lot of fans as well. And uh, just really looking forward to the atmosphere of this game and playing at home. UIC has one of the hottest players in the country in Kelsey Barlow. You know, it's hard to look and find any player that's gone 38 one game and then followed up with another 31 per, uh, point performance. He is offensively dimensional, is one of the highest level players we've played against. He can pass shoot, um, he's 6'5 point guard. So, And they always guard you. They've done a great job, Howard does, of, of getting up in you and, and guarding you. So, um, But I anticipate uh, neither one of us as the head coaches are going to have to coach effort tomorrow. I, I anticipate both teams playing extremely hard and being a fun game to watch.